Welcome to Linwood Park for round 25 of the MPL New South Wales women's competition as the MacArthur Rams take on Bulls FC Academy. The MacArthur Rams with victory today and results going their way elsewhere. 14, Miku Sunaga. Number 16, Maya Lobo. Number 17, Indy Bryan. Number 32, Beth Gordon. Number 35, Tenille Hay. And number 44, Kelly Brown. Souza, ball in again now. Here's the chance for Naimi. Excellent work from the Bulls to kick this one off. Chance is still there. Phillips, saved by Morrissey. Comes back again. Naimi, oh, and she's got it all wrong. Here's Brown now. Brown, Brown driving forward. Has a go from distance and, and looked good as well. Coelho was sore, but... The ball just came over a foot. It doesn't matter because Caceres now has the opportunity. Here's Breyer onside. Indy Breyer sends it wide. What an opportunity. Out there to Caceres. Ball played through for Brown. First time touch for Breyer. Good position for Breyer. This time squares it up for Kelly Brown. And Quello with an excellent save. So brave from the Bulls keeper. One points. And into fourth place. But first, Kelly Brown now into the area. Great position for Brown off the post. Tried to pass it beyond Isabella Cuello. Gordon came across, made the challenge. Caceres, great feet. And excellent technique to find Bronte True, who's got so much pace. And look at Liz Gray coming across. Touch let down Bronte True in all fairness. But defending by the Bulls, and now they can break through Phillips. But look at Tanil Hay rolling back the years. Gets back. Wins the ball as the halftime whistle goes. 0-0 zero, zero between the MacArthur Rams and Bulls FC Academy. Both teams have had opportunities. MacArthur, no doubt, the better the first half. Her effort going just wide of the target. It's not to say that the Bulls didn't have chances of their own. They were quite good in that first 45 minutes and put the Rams under some considerable pe pressure at moments, but were unable to capitalize. Wide for True, just a little behind the winger. True goes direct, Bronte True with a spectacular goal to give the MacArthur Rams the lead. It was speculative. He's Brown. Stayed on side. Kelly Brown saw the space. Tried to get in there. Almost drops in the path of Caceres. Does for Brown. And Kelly Brown takes full advantage of the gift. Taken short there by Lobo for Tenille Hay. Ball comes in. Looked as though it came off the hand there. But Breyer will have a go. Indy Breyer! Oh, and what a finish! From Indy Breyer. The pass for Sloan. And how about that from Olivia Sloan. First time pass for Kelly Brown. 101. Brown slots it away. Makes it four. And what an assist from Olivia Sloan. Through wonderfully. And now Brown spreads it wide for Breyer. Bronte True is there in support. Breyer goes on her own. And Indy Breyer doesn't miss this time. She had a similar position in the first. Put it wide. This time goes the near post. And now the chance for the Bulls to get one. It's Woodall. Woodall off the bar. It was a great opportunity. Roche got a touch to that. And that's full time at Limwood Park. It'll all come down to the final game of the season as the MacArthur Rams defeat Bulls FC Academy by five goals to nil. A dominant display by the current league leaders.